did you know that you can use herbs and botanicals to balance your hormonal system? Just a really quick disclaimer that I'm not a medical professional. This is all based on my own knowledge, research, and experience, and let's dive into this video. So first things first, it is so important, and I can't stress the importance enough, that you get a hormonal test done. This is really important to see where your testosterone levels are, where your estrogen levels are, because there are certain herbs and botanicals that can boost or lower either of these hormones, and if you don't know where you stand, then you can't make the best decision on which one to take. Now, the hormonal test that I personally get done is the Everly Well test. There are a bunch of other ones out there. You can go through your doctor, but it will be a little bit expensive. I think the Everly Well test will run you between $100 and $150, and it's really important that you get one of these tests done, like I said, because you don't know which herb or botanical to take if you don't know where your hormonal balance is. For example, I got one of the Everly Well tests done, and I'm about to get another one done, and you take it during certain times in your cycle. So you will draw blood and put it on this card and then at the certain times it tells you when in your cycle and then you mail it in and then they give you your, your results. So it does take about a month or a month and a half to finish the actual test, get it sent in and get your results back. For me personally, I found that I had really high estrogen levels. There are a variety of different reasons why your estrogen might be high, why your testosterone could be high, or why they are low. So let's look at some of these herbs that can help balance these imbalances and maybe you would like to give them a try. Hormones are really important because they play a crucial role in a lot of different systems within our body. From metabolism to mood to reproductive health, you can see how important it is. When our hormones are in balance, this is when we start to see different symptoms, health issues come into play. First up, let's discuss herbs and botanicals that can help lower high testosterone levels. This includes things like saw palmetto. I actually have some right here. I was taking this to try to help with acne because saw palmetto helps to lower testosterone. If you have high levels of testosterone, you may find that you have more oily skin and more acne prone skin and saw palmetto can help with that. I personally no longer take it anymore, but I've heard really great results from taking 160 milligrams twice a day. Spearmint is also really great. So if you enjoy spearmint tea, this one's for you. It's very easy to consume. It tastes great and it helps keep your body from producing more testosterone, which can hopefully help you balance it out. For those that are dealing with high estrogen like myself, there are certain herbs that can help balance out those levels of estrogen. Herbs like white peony and chaseberry can help balance out those estrogen levels, lowering them naturally. Now, if you are someone that has lower testosterone, let's talk about herbs and botanicals that you can take to boost your testosterone levels. Ashwagandha and Tribulus terrestris are two great ones. These herbs are believed to enhance testosterone production and balance overall hormonal health. Similarly, if you are looking to increase your estrogen levels, there are herbs and botanicals to help that too. Red clover and dong quai are two great ones. These two contain phytoestrogens, which are plant-based compounds that can mimic the effects of estrogen and help the body boost estrogen naturally. And last but not least, let's talk about herbs and botanicals that can help overall hormonal health and balance. Adaptogenic herbs like rhodiola and holy basil are known for their ability to help the body's stress response and promote overall hormone harmony. These herbs also regulate cortisol levels, which I've talked about in another video. Having high cortisol is never a good thing. And with these herbs, helping to balance out those cortisol levels can help regulate and promote balance within the endocrine system. And there you have it. That's a glimpse into using botanicals and herbs to help with overall hormonal harmony, health, wellness, and balance. So whether you are looking to increase your testosterone, lower it, increase estrogen, lower that, or just have an overall balance of your hormonal health, these are some ideas to help get you started. Remember to always consult with a healthcare professional before adding anything new to your supplement routine. Let me know if you want me to go into more depth on one of these herbs that's mentioned in this video. And thanks so much for watching today. We're all botanical queens and I'll see you soon in the next video.